So Compound Cut Club was founded by me and Julius. We opened last year, August 2019, and with like five, six people, but we had connections with other barbers. That's why the whole team is here, right? We got nine, ten barbers now. Pretty much any service needs of a man, women, color, haircut for women's and men's, beard, every shape, we pretty much do it. Business-wise, February 2020 for Confound was like the best month yet. Like everyone was busy, everything was going good. We were actually pretty excited because like we're doing so good, me and Jules. There are some restrictions with COVID now because so we're not allowed to do beards at the moment. Yeah, that's a good thing with COVID change. Emotionally, it's sad because we're not seeing as many people every day. It's like a fast change. It wasn't expected. I guess nothing's expected in life, but it was just every day we were used to coming here, seeing the whole, the whole squad, the whole group of barbers, because we all love coming here, cutting hair. All of a sudden, that was changed. So economically, well, barbers and us got like the syrup. A lot of us pretty much got that. There was really nothing we could have done because we weren't allowed to do services. We mainly get our cash flow from services. There, we do retail on the side, but it was tough still because we weren't here anymore. We were just at home. Sometimes I would do like a delivery for a product or something just to get some cash flow. Like hair products. Yeah, hair products and like wax and stuff. I don't know why clients needed them in pandemic. They weren't doing anywhere. Like, what are you trying to look good for? Your mom? <laughs> Plans wise, I guess, I don't know. We're still brand new, right? We do plan on opening a second barbershop. Me and Joe's always talk about it, but we're still brand new. What is it? August, September? In. We haven't even done our first anniversary yet. I do have a following on Instagram, same with Compound. Um, other barbers follow us. We have guidelines and safety measures and all that. So sharing that online spreads awareness, I guess, to make sure the guidelines is there to keeping people aware. We tell our clients, hey, if you want a haircut from us, you can't be just messing around, drinking, touching other people's stuff, right? So we encourage still doing social distancing. And if I see them doing stupid stuff on online, just, I can just tell them, yo man, I just don't feel safe cutting my hair. Yeah. They'll understand, right? It's my it's my choice, it's my safety, it's the barbershop, and we're, we're allowed to do that. We're allowed to deny it's a service, right? Obviously, we haven't been cutting for three months now, that's the longest time any of us probably have gotten off of barbering, yeah. off cutting. So, see how things go in the first two, three months back. And then, yeah, me and Jules got lots of stuff planned. The clients don't have to worry about us like closing down. I don't think it's ever in the head in doubt. If you haven't heard of Compound, we're in like, Chinatown, Edmonton. Um, we're following all the guidelines to ensure that all clients are safe so prior to booking we like tell them to do a self-screening test online and then all, all the barbers are required to wear masks right now i'm not wearing a mask because it's kind of far but usually they come in wear masks and then hand sanitizer all barbers are cleaning their stations all barbers are two meters away from each other and we're taking all precautions because safety is our main priority. Um, come check us out if you haven't heard of us. Compound Cut Club, 1065 298th Street. You can book on booksy.com or the Booksy app. And yeah. Okay, so yo, I'm hungry. Cut that out, eh? <laughs> so, Keep that in. I guess. <laughs> yeah.
<laughs> Told you guys I was gonna be hungry. Yeah. Just came straight from Calgary before this, man. Yeah, we got food All this. night we drove nonstop, took pictures. But uh, let's uh, just ask that question again. Back. Yeah. Saved you some work on editing, bro. Just we'll look for the clap. We'll look for the clap in the middle. Storms are opening up again. Yes. June 16th. <laughs> Sorry, bro, yeah.